We'll be right back after this message. In today's fast-paced world, this... Policeman's ball is being held at the old school hall near the Callahan Bridge, and they'll be looking for some old school action. Now, I got girls all over town walking the street. Get them to the ball. They'll make a bundle. Get as many of them as you can before the cops drink away their green. technology of absolutely no use to anyone. You can find it at House of Tomorrow. Remember, only technology makes life worth living. House of Tomorrow. We'll upgrade your system, then you can upgrade your life. And now it is my great pleasure to welcome Fernando Martinez, who it says here is the founder of Fernando's New Beginnings, a revolutionary new way of saving your marriage. Fernando, welcome. The pleasure is mine, Laszlo. It is an honor to be here. I feel blessed. Uh, thanks. So, tell me about Fernando's new beginnings. Truly, Laszlo, it is a miracle, a blessing. It is a revolution in the marriage guidance. For my people, marriage is, how do you say, sacred. The bond between the father and the mother, it is made in heaven and in the bedroom, if you know what I mean. Uh, I think so. For my people, it is the holiest, most sacrosanct thing imaginable, like a church. Yet, for it to be a happy marriage, it must also be like a brother. The woman, she must be many, many arts. Be skilled in making house, cooking, changing the diapers on the babies. And she must also be a whore, a vixen in the bedroom, imaginative, exotic, constantly. It is impossible. You change diapers and then you are a French maid? Fernando thinks not. Fernando knows not. Well, I mean, you know, it's an age-old problem. I mean, how do you keep the excitement in a marriage? Excitement, exactly. Passion, danger. How, Laszlo? How? Tell me how, and I give you a big, big kiss. Like I gave a woman. But I am not going to give you a big kiss. Not a kiss like I gave a woman, or even a donkey. Because, because you do not know. Well, I mean, in this case, ignorance uh, kind of seems like bliss. I, I wasn't really up for kissing on air. I mean, why not, Laszlo? Am I not attracted? Am I not irresistible even to you? Well, no matter. Why all this talking about kissing? I mean, you brought it up. No, my friend. You say you not want to kiss me. I was talking how to say, hypothetically, to make me all personal. It's a big difference. If I say, imagine if your wife was ugly, you can nod your head. But if I say, hey, Laszlo, your wife, she looked like yesterday's dinner after I eat. You not so happy. It's a big difference. Anyway, the marriage is impossible. Now. If a man was born an angel, maybe impossible. But a man is born a man. And a man with knees. He needs a woman to tuck his babies into the bed. But for his bed, he needs something else. Something else. So he starts flirting with the secretary, takes her out for a drink, one thing leads to another, and before you know it, he's found all kinds of uses for the office furniture. Exactly, Laszlo. I know what you are like. I see it in your eyes. A wonderer, a dreamer, a man who has needs, but an idiot. And I can save you. And I can save your marriage. <laughs> My marriage doesn't need saving. Hey, do you want to mentioning the prettiest system and the office furniture and the Aikarama, my friend? Listen, Laszlo, and listen very closely. Your marriage is a gift. It oppresses your people, but you are a man. I think we see by now you are no angel. I can save you. For when a man, he sees wife, a guy all dirty, with a dirty diaper, and a dirty panties, and a scrubby brush, and who knows what else. He's not thinking of marriage bad. He's thinking about, well, you think thinking about your pretty assistant. You already know that. Um, go on. But Laszlo, what if you act on your fantasy for your little secretary with the short skirt and the eyes? They're smiling. What then, my friend? What then? Um, I get a sexual harassment suit. If you are lucky, my friend. But you, more likely, your marriage is ruined. Your sweetheart, she hates you. Your pretty secretary, she wants you to be her man. Your back is two square one. My friend, you and a thousand men like you. For me, once it was so. But then one day, I was driving my car, 
and I realize, Fernando, you are blessed. You are a miracle. A thousand miracles roll into one. You save the marriage and you save the man. You don't put the marriage first and you don't put the man first. Maybe we call it man marriage. Then I think to myself, no, this is a bad name. It sounds really dumb. Then I think we call it Fernando's New Beginnings because that is what it is. A new beginning, Laszlo. So how does this work? It is a miracle, Laszlo. A miracle. A man is a good father, a loving husband, a winner of bread, six and a half days a week. On the spare half day, I save his life. How? By giving him what he needs in a controlled environment. I give him passion. <laughs> what, with you? That kind of sounds like a limited mark. Last night, you are very prejudiced. I don't like that.